our rare Elvis photos, friends, fans, and family. Let's get into another video here. Um, and before that, please like, subscribe, hit all notifications, uh, share the video around. And if you can become a member, go ahead and click on that uh, join button on the bottom left. Thanks so much. So let's get into the video. Everybody uh, knows about Elvis Presley's Palm Springs house um, on Ladera Circle. Uh, that was where Elvis Presley had his... Um, his honeymoon with Priscilla. It was 1350 Ladera Circle. He rented it in 1966 for uh, $21,000. Um, and um, of course he had the honeymoon there in May of 1967. The house is pretty remarkable in its own right. It kind of looked like a UFO. Everything was circular in that house. And let me tell you a little story about that. Uh, when I was 19 or 20 years old, of course I lived in California. I'm from uh, the desert of California. So I played many clubs in Palm Springs out there in Pioneer Town. Uh, near Joshua Tree in Yonka Valley. Um, but when I discovered this house was Elvis Presley's honeymoon house and got the address for it, I hopped the fence. <laughs> there was nobody living there at the time, thankfully. But I hopped the fence and I managed uh, to get inside the house as well. Uh, so I actually got a chance to check out the house and maybe I shouldn't disclose that, but that's a long time ago. Um, and I got a piece of stucco from the house, a small little one. Uh, Anyhow, I don't have any of that stuff anymore, but I, I did uh, I did hop the fence and get inside the house. But I was not aware of Graceland West until recently, um, which is interesting because, uh, you know, I know a lot about Elvis and just like you guys do, uh, you guys and gals, gals and guys. Uh, and I know plenty of you know about this house, but um, this house was something that Elvis Presley bought. Um, and I believe it was 1970 that he bought it. Uh, and he recorded some some cool songs. He recorded Blue Spanish Eyes Blue in his house. Blue Spanish Eyes, teardrops are falling from your Spanish eyes. Are, are you, uh, are you sincere, sincere, sweet Angeline? Uh, and um, he owned it for seven uh, for seven years. Um, purchased, purchased it for $105,000. Wow, wish I could purchase it for $105,000. I would do that. Um, but, you know, after the divorce in 73, this was where Elvis Presley uh, went out to... I mean, he lived out here quite a bit, two, three months out of the year. Uh, in fact, he spent his birthday uh, here uh, in 1977. His final birthday was spent at this house. So enjoy the photos. Um, you know, I'm going to try to find some more stories about this, obviously. But um, the fact that this house wasn't mentioned as much, it seems like it was kind of secretive. Maybe a, maybe an escape, a hideaway for Elvis Presley to go. And I hope he had... Uh, you know, some good times at this house. I do uh, know that he actually built a a roof over a 16-person hot tub that he added on to this house. It was 5,040 square feet, uh, which is a pretty big house. I mean, my house is about 2,500 square feet, and I think it's pretty decently large, but obviously we're talking about the king of rock and roll here. Uh, it had a 16-person jacuzzi, uh, and uh, it had a personal bedroom suite. Also had a room built on that he called uh, the jungle room as well so that's hence why they call it Graceland West um, I want to know if anybody's been to this house that's toured it or because uh, I would like to actually uh, go tour it I would like to act like I'm gonna buy it and go check it out so anyways um, <laughs> uh, before this house was uh, owned by Elvis it was owned by the McDonald's uh, founder Ray Kroc and then Frankie Valley bought it in 1981 um, after Elvis, of course. Um, after, of course, it got sold after Elvis' death. So anyhow, uh, thanks so much for watching the video. Please share it. Uh, I hope that I brought this piece of news and this bit of uh, Elvis Presley history to you. Um, and you've never heard about it because that's what this channel is about. Love you guys. Take care. TCB. Also, if there was any doubt that Elvis loved his red carpet like he had at Graceland, here you go in Graceland West. Uh, the address to this house is 845 Chino, uh, 845 West Chino Canyon Road in Palm Springs. If anybody's in California and want to check it out.